Well, the wisest person that I have ever heard. It's got to be Gus, right? Absolutely! Have you been pondering the imponderable? I have been contemplating the uncontemplatable! Really? I've been wondering the unwonderable! The unwonderable? I don't even think un unwonderable is a word. It's totally a word! I just made it up, therefore it's a word! A word is a word once you say the word! Alright, so what have you been contemplating this week? Well, you know, I was thinking about something deep. Really? Yes, deep. Deep, 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 deep. That's pretty deep. That's very deep. Maybe I should talk deep. No, I like your normal voice. Okay, okay. So I was thinking about something, and I was wondering the other day, I saw a policeman drive by, and I was just wondering, how do policemen handcuff a one-armed man? Uh... I don't know. They catch him, he robs a bank, and they try to put the handcuffs on, and they're like, the other part, the other part's like that really. Okay, I'm not even gonna think about that one too much. Okay, you ever heard of a, a, a nonchalant person? Someone that's acting nonchalant? Yeah, I've heard of that but how come you've never met a chalant person? A what? A chalant person. I mean, I've heard of acting nonchalant, which means you're not chalant, but what if you are chalant? What? That makes no sense. I know! I want to act like a chalant person. I don't want to be nonchalant. I want to be chalant. So how do I act chalant? I have no idea. You're going to have to look up chalant in the dictionary. I tried. It's not there. Deep. Deep. You know, that reminds me. Whenever I go to the candy store, I always try to order perils. What's that? I don't know. See, my favorite candy is non-perils. They're the little round chocolates with the little white speckies on top. I love those. So when I go to the candy store, I always say I'd like to get a bag of perils. And they look at me like, we don't sell perils. You do that? I do. And they say, we don't have perils. And I say, well, I'd like to get some perils. They're like, we don't sell perils. I'm like, come on, you got to have perils. They're my favorite candy. And they say, we don't have perils. I say, fine, I'll just get some non-perils then. You seriously do that? I do. Oh, but they love you. Uh, anyway, so what's uh, something else that you would like to wonder about? I was wondering, if somebody scares you half to death twice, are you dead? Uh, no. Uh, no. Why not? Two halves make a whole? No, 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 because if someone scares you half to death, now you're half dead. And if they scare you half dead to death again, now you're three-fourths dead. That makes no sense. It sure does. Because if you're half dead, you have half a life dead left, right? Yeah. And if they scare you half to death again, now you're only half of a half dead, so now you're three-fourths dead. Well, what if, what if they scare you half to death again? Well, you've got 75%, so now you're seven-eighths dead. What? And if they scare you half to death again, now you're 15, 16. This is way too much math for Sunday morning. This is way too much math for any day of the week. <laughs> Ask your math teacher. Okay, too much math. Okay, so how about this? The other day, I was driving down the street, and I saw a Mini Cooper, okay? That officer there, he's probably seen lots of Mini Coopers. Hello, officer. Thanks for all you do. We appreciate your service. Maybe, maybe the officer can answer this one. Okay. So, I want to know, Mini Coopers are too small, okay? All right? I can't, can't take all my friends. I can't take all my stuff. So I went to the Mini Cooper store, and I said, I just want to buy a Cooper. What? Yeah, I want to buy a Cooper. I don't want a Mini Cooper. I want a, I just want a Cooper. Maybe a medium Cooper. Maybe a large Cooper. In fact, I want a Maxi Cooper. A Maxi Cooper? Yeah, can you get a Maxi Cooper? No, you can only get a Mini Cooper. If there's only a Mini Cooper, why is it called a Mini Cooper? It should just be called a Cooper. You can't have a Mini Cooper if there's not a Cooper. It's not a Mini Cooper, it's just a Cooper. Okay, you're getting way too worked up over this. It's like when you go to a store and they only have medium fry and large fry and there's no small. So the medium is not a medium, it's only a small. Which, he's really getting worked up over this. Okay, okay. I also want to know how far east you have to go to get to west. What? Yeah, how far west are you going to go to get to east? I don't know. If you go east, you just go east forever. Really? But if you go north, you get to the North Pole. And if you go south, you go to the South Pole. How come 
there's no East Pole in West Pole. Okay, because north, all the north, no matter where you're at on the planet, it all goes north and they all come together at the North Pole. Yeah, where Sandy lives, right? Or is he South Pole? I don't know. And if you all go south, it all goes to the South Pole. Yes, how come east doesn't go to the East Pole? So there is no East Pole. If you go east, you just go round and around and around and around and around. Really? Yeah. If the North Pole goes to the North Pole, south goes to the South Pole, north, south, north, south. If you go east, it just keeps going east. If you go west, it keeps going west. East, west, east, west, north, south, north, south. You are very coordinated. What? I'm just impressed with your eye, my hand coordination. Thank you. You know what? That's actually why the Bible says that God does not consider our sins as far away as the north or the south because they have an end, which would mean that God's forgiveness has an end. He said that our sins are as far as the east is from the west, not the north and the south, but the east and the west, because his forgiveness is never ending, like the north and south end, the east and the west never end. And that was written before the north and the south pole had ever been discovered. I'm feeling a little sick. You're very coordinated. Stop that. I can't help following it. How do you do that so well? I'm trying to trick you.